welcome to the first unboxing for the Reed Pile. I hope you enjoy. Rick, you want to get us started? Uh, yes, uh, thank you for my non-introduction. That was the angry nerd girl L, as normal. And uh, <laughs> I am the Sussman, Rick Sussman. But it's our first unboxing, so it's okay. This is the DC Comics Bombshell Zatanna statue, uh, numbered limited edition. Um, we're going to start off by just showing you the box itself, and it's got a lot of really nice piece. The, the box itself is a nice piece in and of itself, I suppose. I said self enough there, right? Yeah. A um, couple of close-ups. Uh, you can see uh, this version of Zatanna. She's got an eyebrow piercing, which is very near and dear to my heart. I'll get to that later. <laughs> um, she's also wearing a... Uh, well, you're the bigger Zatanna fan. She, she always sort of wore a corset, right? So this is sort of like that. Yeah, it you know, the best way to say it is that it is her traditional... Her, her, her look? Her, yeah, her get-up. And uh, you can uh, see there's the, the wand. The big bow in the front is a little something different. Well, that's, that's more the style for this particular bombshell yeah, look, right? Yeah, and, and I like it. I, it. It's a good look for her. Well, it's a good box so far. Let's see what else we got on here. Um, there's some other statues to collect. Uh, obviously, we have Zatanna, the Mistress of Magic. By the way, Mistress of Magic becomes important later. Let's see if you're playing at home. Um, they also are doing the Harley Christmas special uh, and the Star Girl, which nobody cares about. <laughs> um, on the back here, you can see an artist uh, rendition of uh, the statue itself. It actually, um, I think, is almost completely accurate to this from the uh, images that I saw of the statue. So uh, you're gonna get uh, you're gonna get the best part, which, well, no spoilers. We'll, we'll explain who that is later. First, you wanted to mention something about the designer and the sculptor, right? Oh, of course. I, I feel that sometimes we don't get to give the introduction of, hey, look who really put work into the statue. Yes, we know who created Zatanna. We know all this history behind it, but who helped with the making of the statue. And so we have the design is by, uh, I'm, I'm so sorry if I mess up your name, <laughs> <laughs> Aunt uh, Lucia. And then we have sculpted by Tim Miller, a little easier to say. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and I, I'm really excited. I, I hope that it's going to look like this artwork that we have on the side here. Um, it does, uh, the box also tells us that the statue will measure about a little over 10 inches tall. Um, if we look at the top of the box, it's got the logo uh, and a, a little version of the image. And the bottom of the box should give us our, no, no, it doesn't give us our number. I thought it would give us our number. Um, but it gives you the DC Entertainment, Manufactured, and of course the ever-important serial number. All right, so that's the box. Let's get to it. Uh, let's see, Elle, if you want to hold the box for me while I peel out the styrofoam. Uh, I will let you guys at home know that we did go ahead and cut the tape. You can put that down. Uh, or, you know, put it, put it right here. It can hang out with our other Zatanna pieces. Let's see by Oh, yeah, there you go. That's good. That's a good one. Let's see if it compares. <laughs> we did cut the tape around the box um, to uh, make this unboxing a little easier, but we haven't yet removed it, so you're going to see what we see. So we're going to take that off. And the top, yes, helpful. So we'll put that there. And wow, this is gorgeous. She comes in a plastic bag, as she should, to keep her safe. Let me get that in there and that in there. Now, let me close that up. Nope, oh, cats are among us. <laughs> well, let's see how uh, she compares to the artwork. This is phenomenal. Oh my goodness. Well, you can see already there's a slight difference with the wand. And uh, we'll be doing close-up shots at the end of the video. Just for, for right now, we're just doing this. But the wand doesn't quite connect to the smoke. I guess they changed that a little bit. And the bunny, who we might as well explain who that. Who is that bunny, L? Oh, oh, I, I think most of us probably already know. But we'll say it. Constantine. That is the John Constantine bunny. <laughs> what this image, what this tells me is what this image is portraying here is that Zatanna has um, transmuted John Constantine into a bunny rabbit for her show. Constantine comes with the tie. It is not felt. That's more sculpture. A cigarette. His blue eyes. His classic hair. The um, sculpt is really a 360 degree sculpt. You can see they even did a great job with her stockings. The painting on here was we got really really fortunate with yeah. our painting. Really fantastic job. 
Um, it's the, hard to find j- just well, any flaw at all in this. And, and, and hand-painted uh, statues, sometimes you'll get, like, a little bit of runoff between the two. And again, I'll, I'll do some zoom-ins a yeah. little later, but, man, the, the heels, her heels don't quite hit the ground. You can see there's a little bit of, little bit of smudge there. Uh, I don't think that's just dust, actually. Well, either way, just fantastic. And um, she has two tattoos across her chest. One is just sort of an image. And the other one is written in backwards, but it is, uh, what is it, Mistress of Magic, but written backwards because, of course, Zatanna speaks backwards. Yeah. So, any other comments you want? How happy are you with this image, Elle, versus I the box art there? I'm very excited. Not a lot of times do you get a statue that really matches up with the artwork on the outside of the box. So, to get that, that matchup is just a little... A little surprise, a little happy surprise, and the idea that they really kept the idea of Zatanna and and when when they were putting this together is just fantastic. And just seeing Constantine as a bunny, if you read her comics, you get the joke. Yeah. You get the joke of their relationship and him being a bunny beside her like that. I love it. Just, I absolutely love it. I adore it. And for just $125, really, really, really good deal. All right. Well, uh, I guess that'll wrap up <laughs> our unboxing, and uh, we'll go ahead and do some close-ups so you guys at home can really check her out. Thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe to the YouTube channel and check out our regular episodes of The Read Pile every Thursday. Mm-hmm.